Good evening, I'm Jeff Smith. Thanks for joining us. Gina Quattrochi has tonight off. A win tonight for the Boilermakers in Mackey Arena will mean a berth in the Sweet 16 in the NCAA Women's Tournament. But win or lose, many local businesses say having the tournament stop in West Lafayette has been good for sales. News 18's Kelly Roberts is live at Mackey Arena with more on how March Madness yeah. has been helping local businesses. Really Kelly? It's cold out there. Jeff. Some businesses are slow during the spring break time, others are busy, but whether businesses are used to being slow or busy, the managers I talk to say they're seeing the positive impact of March Madness. Purdue students were back in class Monday after being off last week for spring break. Restaurants around campus usually see fewer sales when students are gone. Jake's Roadhouse manager Jose Fogelman expects to be more busy Monday night as thousands of students get back into the swing of the school week and enjoy a few NCAA tournament games. We're going to have more students back in town. I think there's a little more, it gets a little more exciting once the tournament gets closer and closer. And then since it's here in West Lafayette, I think we'll have a good outcoming, especially of alumni and then older, you know, people coming to see the games. However, Fogelman does not have to make up as many sales as usual the week after spring break. He said since West Lafayette hosted the women's NCAA tournament, business has been more steady for this time of year. We get a lot more people, um, again, who come out of town that don't know about, you know, where to go. So this is a sports bar that a lot of people will come here first. Because of the indoor water park, spring break is usually a busy time for the staff at the Lafayette Best Western. But it became even more busy this weekend as one of the teams playing at Mackey Arena, Florida Gulf Coast, stayed at the hotel. The original block was for 30 rooms, but then we ended up seeing about 74 rooms out of it. Director of Sales Alyssa Moreland says the extra reservations caused the hotel to be booked the whole weekend. Jose Fogelman expects crowds to continue to come into Jake's to watch the men's and women's games on television. And Alyssa Moreland says staff at the Best Western will be busy with the spring break season for about another three weeks. Then they're gearing up for football season. Reporting live in West Lafayette, Kelly Roberts, News 18. 